this video is checking the accuracy of your hygrometer or uh, the correctness of your hygrometer. I have noticed that all my hygrometers seem to read different. It's like I could do a Jerry Seinfeld. What is the deal with hygrometers? I think that they put the people who are competent they, in the factories, they make thermometers and the people who are incompetent, they ship them over to the hygrometer department. Anyway, to check the accuracy of your hygrometer, it's very easy. You just take a, a salt solution, you just take some salt, table salt, just sodium chloride, you fill a shot glass up maybe, add a couple capfuls of water and stir it around and you just make it so it's like a wet sand is what you would do. Just a little slurry but more like a wet sand actually. And uh, then you put the wet slurry shot glass which it happens to be right in here right now um, with your hygrometer and salts have a funny uh, quality about them. Um, table salt has the quality in between like about 60 and 80 degrees in a closed environment a wet sand, a wet salt solution will go to 75 percent relative humidity and uh, if you leave it in the bag and let it uh, uh, acclimatize for about eight hours and this has been in there about 11 hours this little bag in a double sealed uh, uh, Ziploc bag plastic bag so let's take these out now as I said they should all read 75 percent and I have never found one that reads the same amount as uh, this, the other ones so let's so all you have to do is add whatever it is. I, I've already written them down. They're already all a little low. This one reads, it's the bottom number here, about 66% relative humidity. It's a Springfield device. I happen to like digital thermometers, hygrometers. This one I just got at Walmart. This one's reading 70, 60, 69% relative humidity which is actually only uh, six percent off which is pretty accurate this is actually the most accurate one I have this and I got this for under 650 has the temperature and, and a hygrometer 69 percent the next one here is uh, another Springfield it's 66 percent and let me pull my salt slurry out here as you can kind of see and maybe even here it's just a little salt wet sand solution kind of and uh, this last one is actually a GE like little weather station thing and it reads 56 percent indoors and this is the outdoor part this has never been accurate at all and now I can completely discount this accuracy it says 16 percent this actually goes outside it's the outside reader so so that's the way you check the accuracy if you have an analog one which I don't happen to care for that much you can actually calibrate it then and then what do you do with this uh, salt solution when you're done well you could pour it into a into a little uh, dish and uh, make some margaritas or uh, do some shots or margarita mix and uh, because after all you've just done a very intense ambitious experiment that took eight hours to complete so there you go you can congratulate yourself and have a nice time.